What is good, everybody out there? Thanks again for checking in to another episode of Court Thoughts, the yeah. channel where we basically talk basketball. Yeah, boy, we back. All right. So today is actually Halloween, and I wanted to do an I wanted to do an episode today. And you know, there isn't really any sort of Halloween themed uh, basketball related videos that I could find that would be relevant. So I thought of the next best thing that's hella scary, and that's flopping. <laughs> so what actually happened was, I was um, I was doing, uh, on the last episode of Tea Talk, if you haven't checked it out, jump over and give it a watch. But on the last episode of Tea Talk, I was actually talking about the, the NBA foul calling rule change, and it got me thinking about the whole flopping, I make the comparison. So anyways, I'm not gonna talk about that anymore, just go check it out, but, Today, we are checking out a new channel. I've got a new, new channel that we're checking out. So the channel is called Lightning Hoops. So make sure you jump over there, give them a subscribe and a like, give them some love. And the video that we are checking out is NBA Actor Moments, Best Flopping Moments. I'm really excited, I'm really looking forward to it. All right, so let's cut this right off here. And let's get into it, let's do it. All right guys, let's check out this new video from Lightning Hoops, let's do it. Julius Randle drives, goes inside, falling away, puts it up, shot, no good. And now the Knicks have to foul, he knock it away, Robert. Oh, bro, get out of here. Get out of here. I can see why he was doing that. Like, because there was a lot of contact before. Like, expecting a call, but man, get the fuck out of here with this shit. Look at the smile on his face and shit. Like, he got the worst of it. But watch Iguodala, has the ball and protect it. Oh, okay. He gets someone land on him, but look at his face, bro. This bullshit, man. Oh. I think he did cop a bit of elbow though. Yeah, he copped a bit of elbow. But Marcus Smart's a great defender. <laughs> He's just expecting the call. But come on, man. Have some dignity. Oh, fuck out of here. And this is another thing. That Grayson dude is a grub. So, that's why he can get away with that shit. Are you kidding me, man? Oh. Legitimately, it's getting out of hand. That's so disgraceful, bro. Oh, bro. <laughs> My man pretended like he got killed, bro. Relax. <laughs> That's so stupid. Oh my god, you're like double the size of him. That's weak. I hate that shit. That's so weak. Dude, talk your shit. Talk your shit. You little bitch. It's a bitch move, bro. Obviously, Clay Thompson uses that off arm, little subtle shove. That's the offensive foul. So weak. Then on the way down the floor, both guys. A little communication. Yeah. Oh. What part? Carter got right up on him and drew the charge. That's the fourth foul on Leonard. <sighs> oh, dude. My man was sending his left shoulder so deep, like he got hit there. It wasn't even touched there. Back up double figures. Nice defense there from Curry. A little hard claiming he got hit in the mouth. Crossover drive, throws it up Capella, and Capella's foul. I didn't see where that foul all was. All the plays. Jump in the comments and tell me if you saw where it was. James has been guarding Butler too. What the fuck? Glitch in the Matrix. <laughs> what the hell was that? 
Oh, I hate that. It's so weak. Come on, Rubio. This is obviously the playoffs there, but still, no excuse for playing so hard. Well, Patrick Beverly, this is what he does best. He's one of the premier defensive players in the league, and he is an Patty Bev does flop to himself, bro. The perfect example of those players where... Because he's just trying to get them foul calls, but he's overkilling them. he's on your team, he's beloved. Very true, very true. Oh. Oh, dude. Oh, I can't take much more of that flopping. I'm so glad that video ended. <laughs> All right, guys, I have to say, it was really frustrating to see some of those, like, oh. let me backstep, let me backstep. Let me, let me try and justify this. I don't have a problem with when contact gets initiated and you try to sell it a little bit, especially on certain like offensive fouls, like charges, you have to, like you can't just stand your ground. I think that's probably a weakness that I have. Sometimes I'm just standing there and I'm like standing the ground and I'm bracing for the hit so much that when the hit does come and it's not as hard as what I expect it to be and I don't move, the foul doesn't get called, which is where you kind of have to go with it. But man, like VC, you made me sad, bro. Like, Vince Carter, you made me sad. He ain't even touched your shoulder. And you fallen like my man shot you in the leg. Oh, but I have to say, I really liked the video lightning hoops. Really good job. Thank you so much. Please make sure, guys, you go over there. You give him a like and subscribe, like I mentioned earlier. But that's going to do it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, please make sure you're looking after yourselves. Stay safe. And eat lots of candy if you're celebrating Halloween. All right, take care. Peace. Thanks for checking out today's episode. I hope you enjoyed it. If you want to see more videos, you can jump over to this section right here and you can check out some more recent videos. Alternatively, you can jump over to this side and you can give the page a subscribe and check out some other stuff you might like. All right, take care. Peace.